you know, I think like Lego had the goal of like, I'm going to Olympics and that's why I'm gonna ride so well. Right. And he did. And my goal was more like, nobody wanted to go to the Olympics more than Kev. Nobody should be at the Olympics more than Kev. And nobody wanted to like see Sean get beat more than Kev. So I w that was kind of more my motivation going forward from there once Kev got hurt was just like, anybody, anybody doing it for Kev is, that's rad, so. Danny Davis and my it, mother and Danny's mom. Can you tell us, tell us a little bit about your son? Oh, I'm so proud of him. I can't begin to tell you. How, how psyched are you that you just won? She's happy. She's she's always happy with me though. She's just she's a proud mother either way. But these it's always nice. She's like my good luck charm. Every yeah. contest she comes to, I do well. No pass out sign on the door set me. Our waitress is paying the price of their life. Yeah, so this is where it gets kind of shitty. Yeah. It was a great, great little season headed up into there. Like I said, like three out of five contests I did, I was one. And. And then that night, you know, uh, we went we went out to celebrate, and uh, and then we just yeah we went out to have some some fun and uh, had too much fun, you know, and did just what everyone always like, what everyone warns you about, you know, like when you're coming up and snowboarding, like yeah, dude, you're doing great, don't but don't get you know too caught up in the partying stuff, don't get too. And you're always like, yeah, yeah, I know. And they're like, yeah, you do a good job with it, you know, you're not. But just remember, you know, stay, stay cool, stay, stay focused. And this was a time where, like, I had, I, you know, I had to stay focused. Like, I made the Olympic team, and like, really, any Olympic athlete would probably be just chilling. And yeah, I just I just made a dumb decision, you know, and so, uh, and and you know, drove drove a four wheeler into a gate, and so, and and really, you know, it was it was all just like a such a quick thing, you know. We won the contest, we drive, we go have fun, and then all of a sudden I was I really don't remember too much. Right. I was out, you know, like right. when I when we when we got in the accident, I was knocked out, and so I think it hit my head pretty hard. So like, uh, I, I don't know, you know, if I don't remember from that or right. or whatever, but yeah, I mean, we were we definitely had drank some beers. We just went for a little cruise, and right. it turned out being a fast cruise, and like weird breathing and out for sure. So he like army crawled to the road, and luckily, like someone just happened to be driving down the road and saw him and luckily because like I'm sure he I think he was bleeding pretty bad so like well in shock for sure and needed to get to a hospital quick so I got up and like I think like put my arm around his shoulder and walked with him I kind of remember that and then I remember being really the first thing I remember is coming into the hospital and it looked exactly like where Kev had gotten where he was like staying in right. Salt Lake so I thought I thought he was there, so I was like, oh, my friend's here, and they were like, no, he's not, and they thought I was talking about my buddy who was in the accident with me, and right. as soon as I woke up and I was laying and I realized I was in a hospital, I was like, I can't believe that I blew that opportunity. Yeah.